Now this video will probably get me killed. Have DHS at my house. Be thrown in jail. IRS attack me. The secret records that they've been trying to coordinate against me, which I've never done anything wrong, will be used to throw me in a mental institution. Because what I'm about to tell you is very, very real. And it is extremely important. And it involves your children. Very soon, you're going to be sold something very convenient. It's going to be that your mind is going to be able to control toys. They're going to test this on your children. And you. It will be... You'll be able to think a thought, and the toy will be able to go from one place to the other. You'll be able to start your car. That's what the GM ignition thing is about. You'll be able to start your car with this technology. Turn on the lights in your house. It will evolve into all kind of mind over energy. Conveniences is what they will tell you. It is not a convenience. It is a massive mind control weapon that every country is in on. Every country in the world is spraying chemtrails. And the reason why they're spraying chemtrails is because they're spraying you with nanotechnology. You have nanotechnology in your processed foods. You've got nanotechnology in your water. You have nanotechnology being pumped in through fracking. You have nanotechnology being pumped through the air. They are in the medical industry, in the flu shots. Everything is nanotechnology, nanotechnology. And the thing is, nanotechnology is forever. If you take Adderall, ADD medication, uh, Oxycontin, you're poisoning the planet because it's nanotechnology. You spray pesticides on your, your plants, nanotechnology. Everyone is involved. It is a giant, giant, giant takeover of the planet. Once that nanotechnology is on the cellular level, once it's in your water system, it stays there forever. I mean forever. It never, ever filters. The earth can never filter it out. Now with that nanotechnology, they're going to allow you to start your car, turn on the lights in your house, move a toy with your mind. But they're also going to be able to tell you to go kill someone or to kill yourself. There will be a central control, just like the movie The Matrix. There will be a pre-crime division, just like Minority Report with Tom Cruise. There will be all kind of suits and weapons and super soldier type structures that they will give you. A race is going on right now. Every nation is trying to get control of the weather. What are they doing with HARP? They are moving clouds around. What are clouds? They're water. What are you? You're just one big water walking around. Water energy. What are clouds? Water energy. What are clouds? Stardust and water. What are you? Stardust and water. They can move a cloud. They can move you. It's called nanotechnology. Remember when the Discovery Channel was saying nanotechnology to go in and heal the body? No. It's not to heal the body. They're using it as a weapon first, just like they've done everything. Just like nuclear bomb. They didn't use it for free energy. They used it as a weapon. As a matter of fact, the nuclear power plants that are strategically placed all over your cities are leaking radiation purposely. Your house right now is a radiation pumping device. The ground wires, the smart meters, a reversing engineer, a radiation field in your home. They're surveillancing you right now with the smart meter. Not only surveillancing you, but they're filling your body with radiation to where you go to the Obamacare and, of course, the government gets a cut the Rockefellers get a cut, the bankers get a cut, and everybody gets rich as you are being slow killed. And the nanotechnology in your body is increasing this energy. I have the cure, and if you subscribe to my website, and you communicate with me, I'll show it to you. I'll tell you the cure. 
But there's a lot of cronies out there that are trying to discredit me. They're cutting and pasting my videos, trying to find some type of damaging evidence to say that I am crazy. Well, guys, Jesus was crazy. Moses was crazy. Noah was definitely crazy. He was building a boat. By the way, Tesla was crazy. You see what they did his family? We find out that all of this nanotechnology, everything, this free energy, all this energy that's floating around that on different dimensions like uh, cell towers, you cannot see the cell phone data that's flowing. You cannot see the satellite signals. Your television signals went from a normal TV signal to a digital signal, and the digital signal is a carrier wave that rides over the warp signature of, your, of the voice energy. What is my voice? It's energy. It's a vibrational energy. Everything on this planet is an energy. That tree is an energy. Your body is an energy. The stars are energy. The planets are energy. Everything's energy. When they tell you that the sun is a gaseous giant and it's exploding on a nuclear reaction, no, it's not. It's an energy ball that's sucking off the darkness. And by the way, we used to worship it. And matter of fact, if there's anything that you want to worship, is the sun. Because without the sun, we're all dead. God created the sun. And if you love God, truly, you'll worship the sun. Absolutely, instead of a religion. The religions will keep you under control and tell you everything's going to be okay. The TV's going to tell you everything's okay. The medias, the news... They're all going to say, we're conspiracy theorists. We're crazy. While they're implementing this program. And if they're in trouble, they've got their underground facilities. Because when is airplanes ever sprayed and the trails just stay there? This is metals. Nano particulate metals. Some people are having reactions to it. Itchy skin, respiratory illnesses. They're dying from it. Some people just can't take it. Some people are rejecting it, just like a, a virus that comes into your body, you can reject it. Let's say you get a heart transplant, your body rejects the heart because it doesn't match with your DNA. Some people are dying from this. Autism is going up 10,000%. Dementia, off the charts, one in three elderly have dementia now. Alzheimer's, one in three. Which is the same disease, all it is is a fluoridated brain. It is a fluoridated brain, plain and simple. That's all it is. So, that's the truth, people. This is what they're doing. Every pesticide, every chemical, every fertilizer that you put, every pill that you take in your mouth is a temptation of Christ. Your smart appliance in your house are surveillance, radiation pumping devices. They're designed to control your mind. So is the TV. And they're emitting sounds that your ears can't hear. The dogs can. You notice these crows, I mean, these uh, crows are crowing all the time. And the roosters are crowing all day long. Why do you think that? Because they have cryptochromes in their eyes. Just like a bird flies from north to south and knows exactly what it is. It has built-in GPS. It's called cryptochromes. It knows exactly the latitude and longitude lines of the earth. It knows exactly where it's at. It knows morning from night. It knows the time of the day. But now they don't. Because you get cell towers floating around dirty energy all over the place. Energy's outside the human residence of the earth. Energy's outside your body from 7 to 11 hertz is the only frequency that we can take. Anything above or below is toxic poison to us and it creates cancer. Now also, these nanoparticulates are definitely cancer causing. It's going to limit your life down to about, uh, you know, you're lucky if you're going to live to 40, 50 years with this nanotechnology. But they'll control your mind and they'll work you from 8 years old on up. Our children are going down lower and lower and lower of their ages. They're being controlled and mind controlled. That's what the television is. Even when you turn on the volume of your TV, you have a carrier frequency that overlays the voice frequency. And it is a mind controlling device. And the only thing that's going to save you is finding God, releasing your possessions, Let's quit buying what they're selling. How are you going to stop these people? Quit buying what they're selling. If everybody today would quit paying their house notes because this is how they're financing it. If everybody today would quit paying taxes because that's how they're financing it. If everybody today would quit buying their foods, grow foods in your backyard, get a cow, go to the local dairy and get milk. Let's make the people in our community wealthy. Thus don't make the corporations wealthy because the corporations are doing this. This is their investment. If you notice that chemtrails are worldwide, because let me tell you, whoever gets this nanotechnology will control the world. 
not only the weather, just like HR 2977, because all it is is water particulates. They'll control the world. The illusion is weather. And that's why they're allowing these guys like geoengineering Dang Wigington to do their shows. Because they want you to focus on the weather. Yeah, you're focusing on the weather, but the real issue is going to be a convenience of mind control. Complete mind control. I'm telling you, when they say commit suicide, you commit suicide, my friend. And by the way, they can arrest you right before you do it and incarcerate you with their pre-crime division. Nanotechnology, my friend. Not used to heal the body, but used as a weapon. God bless. This is not only from my heart and my mind, but this is from God. I've prayed about this. This came to me. Turn the electricity off in your house. Call the the power companies and say, I do not want electricity anymore. Do whatever it takes. Get solar power. By the way, your solar power, you do not want a ground wire. If you can live without, we've lived without electricity before. Let's don't let them control us with something that we feel like we need, like a cell phone. We don't need it to live. We don't. We don't need their jobs. Every job that you have right now is a corporate job. And they, you are, they are controlling you and your mind. Corporations. Don't let them kick you out of your home. This land is yours. God gave it to you. He didn't give it to the rich. He hates the rich. Jesus hated tax collectors. He did not pay taxes. He would not pay taxes. Read the Bible. Read Luke. Read Matthew. Now, he accepted the tax collectors into his home and he tried to teach them the truth, but they had the choice to reject the truth, which is money or God. Everybody does. Everybody right now has a choice, money or God. That's your choice. You can take, you can take your kids towards money or you can take your kids towards God. It's your choice right now. Love or money. Love or hate. Love or fear. It's all the same thing. That's why that TV is just a fear-pumping device. God bless. I love you all.